Um, I think my biggest impact that I felt this week, obviously I believed in NFIB or I wouldn't have joined 13 years ago when I was a business owner myself. Mm -hmm. So the biggest impact I had was coming here and seeing that everyone else had that belief. Um, and my belief was the main reason that I joined NFIB as a business owner and NFIB as an employee. And the fact that you saw it multiplied over and over and over again through every employee that came through the store that talked to us, through everyone in my class, um, through Randy, through both, of, through all of our instructors, just helped to see me that yes, this was an organization that I wanted to be involved with, that it was a good organization 14 years ago when I joined as a business owner, and it's a great organization now that I'm working for it. Um, also, that impacted me was the level of commitment and the level of enthusiasm that everybody that came through here talked to us had. The level of enthusiasm that all of all of my counterparts here have. Um, we're extremely enthusiastic about our job. We enjoy what we're doing. Everybody seems to enjoy what they're doing, and that to me was very important. Um, my commitment is I plan on spending an extra hour in the field every day, not so much for time-wise, but because I feel like that I can do an extra presentation every day, but it's important to me to be able to make that presentation perfect. Uh, because as long as it is perfect, then I can focus on other things. If that habit becomes in such a way that I don't have to consciously think about what I'm doing, then I can focus on other things. Thank you. Here is a small gift. Thank you. There is a love note in there for you, too. Okay. Love note for everybody. So Liz, what we want to say to you is thank you not only for being here and not only thank you for being a member, but, but your confidence is just contagious. I mean, the way that you operate, your whole persona of being confident, um, just it not only smacks of professionalism, but it just it's really the core of what we do. Just thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank you. I was asked a question uh, when I was boarding the plane, you always make small talk, or at least I always make small talk. And I met uh, another individual that was uh, headed to Austin, and he asked me, he said, what do you do? And I said, I work for NFIB. Uh, the impact that this class has had on me personally and, and my career is I now, I now have a direction uh, of where I'm headed. I now know where I'm going. And it's a combination of planning. It's a combination of recognizing Thorne, uh, first off, acknowledging his presence. Uh, I have a good habit of hiding him. Uh, but now that I'm aware he exists and that he's hungry, I know what to feed him. And uh, how to feed him, that's, that's key. Uh, the impact that the, the class that you all have had uh, uh, on me personally has just been phenomenal. I, I won't forget any of you. Um, I feel like a, a week we've spent together, I've, I've actually this week I've seen you more than I've seen my son. And so uh, we're family now, and, and I appreciate it uh, all the time that we've spent together. Uh, <coughs> on the bus, you guys waiting on me. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, and I wish you all the best of success uh, here at NFIB or, or wherever this uh, road of life leads you. Um, commitment, 30 day commitment, that's tough for me. I'm going to take it one day at a time. Uh, that's what I, uh, I know best. And, and so Monday, uh, my commitment is going to do 12 presentations to 12 different potential members uh, verbatim. I'm going to walk the walk and I'm going to talk the talk. And I'm going to try it every day for the next 30 days. Thank you. Aaron, where do we start? One thing I'll say that I've noticed about you all week while I've been sitting next to you is your willingness to learn. You've always had that pin going. You've always had a question, and you've been like a sponge. You've soaked up everything that everybody has come in here to say. Um, and that will make you better in your career. 
and um, just keep doing what you're doing. Because you have a great personality, you engage everybody in this room, and you've allowed us to pick on you and, and just take it with a grain of salt. This has been an incredible week. Uh, when I first heard I was going to be coming out to 101, I was ecstatic because I knew I had a lot of weaknesses. I had a lot of things that I needed to improve on. And everybody I talked to, not just my comrades and, and along with me, everybody I've met this week, including the, the trainers and uh, Randy and, and just the whole crew, has just been incredible. And it, it's far exceeded my expectations. I mean, the impact, uh, I, I, I can't narrow it down to one thing. I mean, the impact of the trainers, the, the people I've met this week, the camaraderie that you feel, the enthusiasm, the, uh, the belief in the, in the system and in, in the program and the FIB in general, just uh, the impact is incredible. I mean, this is, this is what I was looking forward to with this meeting. I wanted to learn closing techniques, handling objections, getting my talk down pat, all of those things. Uh, I traveled with Lou when we were out making sales yesterday. Uh, he did a phenomenal job in regards to every time we came out of a door, he'd say, okay, what did you do right? What did you do wrong? And he has this good, better, best attitude. He, he doesn't like, like I, I would ask him, well, uh, where did I choke in there or something of that nature. But he told me, I go good, better, best, and here's what you did right, and here's what you need to improve on, and, and I, I learned a fabulous amount of information just from him. So he, he was a big help. He was a huge impact, as was Randy and, and Bart and the rest of the team here. But uh, just uh, the enthusiasm is just, uh, it's contagious. It's, and just all of you folks, the, the, it's nice to talk. I had a lot of conversations with several of you uh, on a personal basis and on a, on a business basis. And it, it's, it's refreshing to have, uh, to, to, to know that you guys are going through the same things that I'm going through. Uh, and then when I hear Randy say, I went one for nine, the best of the best is telling you that. So, you know, you, it gives you a new focus and new beliefs. So everything impacted me this week. This meeting was incredible. My commitment, uh, I, I hear all week that if, if you have your talk down, you have your rebuttals, you have everything else in place, if you can do 10 to 12 presentations each and every day, you're going to be successful. That's my commitment, is 10 to 12 uh, presentations each and every day. And I appreciate everybody's support. Uh, I love the camaraderie, not just with the management folks, but also the, the rest of us out there. So. Thank you very much, and I, I absolutely appreciate this meeting this week. It's incredible. Tom, I've enjoyed having you in my group this week. I'm impressed with your openness and your willingness to learn. And one thing that impressed me is you talked about how you lost your job from a previous job and how this is so much different really than what you did before. And it impressed me that how you've made such a career change, even though you were in sales, this is a different type of sales, and how you were able to adjust and adapt and make that career change, and I think you're going to go for it too. Mm -hmm.